Walk MS returns to downtown Toledo after two virtual years because of the pandemic. Hundreds of people took to the streets to raise awareness for multiple sclerosis as well as those living with it. Our Kaylee Kirby has more on that event. It's a lot of fun. It's exercise. You get your steps in, get your Fitbit on. Come on. More than 500 people had the same idea. Get their exercise and steps in while raising awareness for multiple sclerosis. Kelly Michael and her family have been participating in these walks for the past two decades. And for them, it's more than just a walk. I've had MS for 22 years. My brother just recently was diagnosed. His mother-in-law has had MS for a while as well. In fact, Stephanie Kumler, who's a specialist with Walk MS, says almost everyone participating in the walk either has MS or knows someone who does. And the disease affects people long after the walk is over. That's why the main goal is to continue raising awareness and money for MS. It's a disease that a lot of people don't talk about. It's one that you can't see from um, maybe someone just like walking in, but it affects a lot of Ohioans. And, um, and the fact of the matter is, is there are treatments right now, but there is no cure. The money that's raised goes towards finding a cure for MS, but also helps pay for treatments. And it's that generosity that helps thousands of others live an almost normal life. They just recently told me that there's a 0% possibility of being totally disabled because of the advances in the medication out there. It's an advance like this that allows us to increase the treatment, get some better medication, and hopefully someday eliminate this disease. Walk MS says if you've been recently diagnosed and need help, you're not alone and can reach out to them. Reporting in downtown Toledo, Keely Kirby, WTOL 11.